it says in an examination it is necessary to get 35 percent of total to pass there should be a full stop after this right 35 percent of the total marks to pass this exam now there are there are three papers a boy gets 62 out of 120 in the first one and 35 out of 150 in the second one right in the first two papers now how much he has to get in the third out of 180 so that he can pass how much we get in the third out of 180 so that he can pass that's very simple he you know how much should he get to pass 35 percent 35 percent of the total so 35 percent of total what is the total see first paper the maximum is 120 second paper the maximum is 150 and the third paper the maximum is 180 the paper i mean total value of each paper is given to us right maximum that you can score 120 150 and 180 so 35 percent of this will suffice to pass now how many did he score he has scored 62 in the first paper he scored 35 in the second paper. How much should he score in the third paper? How much he has to get in the third paper out of 180? Let's say he has to get uh, M marks in the third paper to pass. Find out M. One equation, one variable. Can you not solve it? As simple as that. 35% of the maximum score of three papers should be equal to the individual scores in the three papers. These two have to be balanced. Solve this now. That it all depends on how quickly do you do the calculation, right? Now 120 plus 180 is 300. 300 plus 150 is 450. Right? 450. 35% of 450. 35% of 450. What is 35% of 450? 35% of 450. 10% is 45. 30% will be 135. And 5% will be 22.5. So 135 plus 22.5, 157.5. You getting me? 35% of 450. So 45, 45, 45, and 22.5. So 45 into 3 is 135 plus 22.5, 157.5. So what we have on the left hand side is 157.5. From these two subtract 62 and 35. It will give you M. Now 62 and 35 is 97, right? So 157.5 minus 97, it will give you 60.5. That's the right answer. Just one equation, one line of numbers and you'll get it, 